If you want to increase trust and boost sales on your Shopify store, in this video I'll show you exactly how to add product reviews to make your store stand out more. So first of all, you wanted to talk about the product reviews. The product reviews are essential for building trust with the customers and can significantly impact their purchase decisions. So reviews add social proof, uh, making it easier for potential buyers to trust your products. How can we do this with our products into the actual website of the Shopify? Well, first of all, to get started, let's go back into Shopify. Here, we're going to head into the home dashboard. You have the link to down below in the description, of course, if you want to get started with a few trials for free and then pay just $1 per month for the next three months if you want to stick around here a little bit more into Shopify. Now, here, I'm going to focus into the section that says application. Now, usually we don't have absolutely anything here. So we can look out for search product reviews in the Shopify App Store. This one should lead us directly into the Shopify App Store where you can just download whatever application you wanted to to add the product reviews since the Shopify does not have this available into the online store editor. So to make this process much more faster, I like to use a lot the judge.me. Now, Judge.me is built for Shopify, has a free plan, and is really easily to use. So let's install this. I'm going to hit into install, and I needed to grant the access between my application and my store. So let's hit here into install. Once you have now installed the application, it should be asking you to activate this widget of the Judge.me directly into your store. To do this process, what you need to do is just to choose the language. Where would you like to install it? Let's go for my current theme and hit into start the setup. Now I needed to click into this section that says enable apt and beam. This is an hyperlink that should be leaving just uh, sending you into this new editor of the Shopify. Inside here, just wanted to make sure that we are into app and beams and the judge.me is enabled. After this one is enabled, hit into the right part that says save. Let's go back. And as you can see, we have now this mark that has now been installed. I'm going to do exactly the same thing with the rest of all the widgets of the judge.me. So click on it, active, make sure that this one is active. You should see how your website are now having this active product reviews. So as you can see, this is just an example, of course, but check out how it actually looks. So if you see it, that means that the widget has now been successfully added into your product uh, page. And lastly, if you wanted to start setting up your branding, you can add your own store logo or to change the star colors. I'm going to change this star colors for black and continue once more. Now this one should be now finished. Let's go into explore dot.me. Inside here, we have the insights of how much uh, reviews we do have available in the Dutch.me. We have reviews over time, reviews generated, questions, orders, and the average rating. Here you have the top products of how many people are leaving their comments, the recent activity, and I can try to pay more to earn and grow my sales. Now into the left part, we have the managed of the reviews. So you can check out all the new reviews that comes directly into your store. You can approve them, you can delete them to send them into spam or to achieve those. The collecting of the reviews can be helping your course to track automatic reviews requests here. So a schedule the request, for example, is to sending manual request for people who already make purchase into your store. So you can incentivize them to rate how was the purchase of the product, what went well, and what could be done great or better from the future. Now, if I click here into widgets, this is the part where I just make sure that the widgets has not been installed. And if you wanted to install something else, you can click here into the option that says customize or install. For example, we have the verified reviews counter, the judge.me medals, I have a floating reviews tab, all reviews counter, and much more. I just wanted to focus with the first three of them because I think this one is more than enough. And here into the marketing and the socials, I can do much more. I can enable coupons so I can send them an active, for example, this banner into my website so people can use this uh, coupon to apply them into my site. 
And lastly, the general settings, where I can just cover all the information about my plan, the branding, modifications, uh, advanced tools, and much more. So let's start with my first review of my product. I'm gonna go back here. I'm gonna go into my dashboard, click into online store, and choose the option that says view my online store. Let's just select one product. Inside this product, I wanted to make sure that I have here this customer review option. If this one is not available, you don't have to worry about that. You can always go back directly into your online store, themes, customized. And once you are inside here into the upper side, I'm going to click in it and choose the option that says products, default product. Here, I wanted to make sure that here into the template, I do have available the option of the judge.me ratings. So for example, this is star rating. I'm going to put this a little bit up of my product and it should be appearing there. So there we go. I saved it. I go back into my preview of the page and I reload the page. Now let's just type my very first review. So let's say good product. And I go for, I really liked the item. And I'm gonna go for four stars with no video or pictures. So my name, you can go for the name once again and submit to the review. Now, as you can see, it says review submitted. How do I make sure that I have now my first review added? Well, for that, let's go back into Shopify dashboard. Inside the dashboard, I'm going to click into apps, click here into judge.me reviews, and basically your first or all, all your reviews should be appearing directly here into the judge.me. So review dashboard. And here it is, my first customer has now sent my rating. So if this one says published, you can hide the review or delete it or to edit the review if you want to. But in this case, it's now been uh, automatically activated because the rating is great and the description is good. So if I reload the page, that means that the next time I check out my product, I will be already having this review here into the upper side. So here it is, Steven, good product, I really liked the item. So I can strongly suggest to you to incentivize your customers to write some reviews about your products, add images, and create their account in order to build more credibility about it. So into the reviews, you can just manage your products, you can manage the moderation of them, you can add more reviews by yourself, you can add questions and answers, and there's much more things to cover here into the judge.me. So the reviews can also improve your store CEO, helping you rank higher on search engines. So the plus, displaying verified reviews increase your social proof, which is key to convincing new customers to buy. Now you know how to add and manage product reviews on the Shopify, you have now helped uh, build trust and boost some sales. You have downloaded Judge.me. You have generated your first review. You have tested your website. And you know how to encourage customers to write their first review of your product. So with that being said, guys, don't forget to check out the other videos for more tips and optimize your Shopify store. Thank you once again. And see you next time.